Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Angie's Jungle House. Hi everybody, and welcome back to Angie's Jungle House. Today I have a little repotting excursion for you. I decided I was going to repot my Chinese evergreen, and I was a little surprised at what I found. Um, it is not the best quality video, but I think you might be a little bit surprised at what I find inside of my pot of Chinese evergreen. Um, I had noticed it was a little bit rebound, so I decided I was going to give it a slightly larger pot. Um, I didn't expect what I was going to find, so I guess, pardon my looks, it's kind of like Sunday fun day sort of thing, and I'm really just kind of doing gardening and houseplant keeping today, so... No need for me to get all dressed up, and I hope you guys don't mind, but continue watching, and until next time, happy growing. My goal is to get as much of this pot these pots, they're both in, both sets are in pots. This is growing through the pot. This is ridiculous. My goal is to get as much of this pot out, these pots, as I possibly can. Push that off to the side. This is the craziest crud I have seen in a long time. I'm trying not to cause damage to the extent of my ability where I can. Um, the roots haven't quite started to coil yet, so I guess that's a bonus. I think I'm going to split these up to give them a little bit more room. Ooh, well, not causing as much damage as possible. Chinese Evergreen Surgery 101. This is ridiculous. I hope you guys can see this all right. Really need to get like a legit camera set up, but. I don't know how well that's gonna work. Oh, jeez. I think people begin to believe that I have 60 black cats. It's just one, I promise. Another, oh, still connected. I missed a piece. And another chunk of pot. This is crazy, guys. Now I'm probably going to have to go through weed out roots. I'm probably going to have to snip some. For the sole fact, I thoroughly believe their roots are growing through each other's pots. I don't know if I'll ever get the bottom of the pot out. Ooh, I actually just might. This is crazy, guys. I'm just dumbfounded. Ah, uh, I can finally see it. This isn't exactly the most comfortable position. They almost look like aquatic pots. That's what I'm dealing with there. That's one of them. I'm going to have some root damage. There. 
All right, so this is the size of that pot. Um, it's kind of relatively about the size of a K-cup. And that came out of that. That's just wild. Unreal. You're going to be a little more bewildered by the next one, I believe. Because all this, guys, that's, that is all one pot. Here, here's a look at how it looks. Thanks. I really wasn't me. I don't even have a pot for this guy, but I just got this overwhelming sense of dread about this plant. It just, it's been doing well. It's just been a little slower than I would have thought. It's a Chinese evergreen. It should go pretty quick. We just got just root follow everywhere. Yeah. Probably help this guy out a little bit. There we go. That's how, in comparison to the palm of my hand, that's how big the pot around was. Let's see if I can even find that pot now. Oh, jeez. That's unreal. Here we go. 